What's up everyone? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, my name is Chrissy. Thanks for joining me. I'm so excited today because I'm going to do a full face makeup using one of my favorite brand, the Fenty Beauty. I've been using this product for quite a while now and I've got some new products from them recently. So I thought, why not let's do a one brand makeup using only Fenty Beauty. So enough the rambling, let's get into the video. I'm gonna start it with priming my face. I actually got this set of foundation with primer and brush at Sephora. This is a limited edition, online only. So it's actually a good buy because this includes the Pro Filter Hydrating Primer and the Pro Filter Hydrating Long Wear Foundation and the Kabuki Buff Foundation Brush, so which is a good deal. So I'm going to use the hydrating primer. It feels so smooth and clean. And it smells so good also. But if you're more sensitive with a scented product, this is probably not for you. But although it's not so bad, it's just like a smell of vanilla. This primer is very hydrating. It makes my face very moisturized. So for the foundation, this is the Pro Filter Hydrating Longwear Foundation. And this is in the shade 240. And I'm gonna use the brush. My skin is dry so I feel like with a hydrating formula it better suits my skin actually this has a dewy glow finish and it says it's medium to full coverage but it looks natural on the skin but it covers all my imperfections which is pretty good So for concealer, since I didn't get one, I'm just gonna use the matchstick in the shade Bamboo. So I'm going to warm it on my hand first. Then to set my entire face, I'm going to use the Pro Filter Instant Retouch Setting Powder.
for my eyebrows, I'm gonna use the dark shade right here on my number three palette. Since I didn't grab one, I, for I totally forgot. I bought so many lipstick from Fenty Beauty and I forgot to buy an eyebrow pencil. What can you do? But first thing, I'm going to apply an eyebrow wax. It's going to give more pigment since we're going to use a powder formula. Then to set my eyes, I'm going to use the same matchstick concealer. Then to set it, I'm just going to use the same setting powder. Now for eyeshadow, I always love this palette right here, especially the number 3. This is very good for everyday makeup. This palette is actually very convenient to bring because these two palettes can actually snap together. This eyeshadow is not very pigmented as the other eyeshadow, but that's make it easy to work with. There are also buttery as well, which makes it so nice to blend.
So now I'm going to complete the look by adding the fly liner in the shade because I'm black. And I'm also going to add a pair of eyelashes. So now to contour my face, I will be using the matchsticks and the shade Mocha. So next one is the blush. I have the cream blush here. This is the petal poppin and the next one is the summertime wine. But for today we're going to use the petal poppin. this blush because it's so easy to apply and it blends so nicely so for highlighter I'm going to use the matchsticks in Trippin So for the lipstick, I got the two Mademoiselle. This is in the shades Spank and Thick and the Stana in the shade Uncensored. But for today, we're going to use the shade Thick. The formula is matte without feeling dry and it's very lightweight. It's a very great lipstick. That's my complete look for Fenty Face. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And please don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. Thanks very much for watching and I hope to see you all on my next one.